What is up, Snickers dicks? I'm Ecstad. Welcome to the Motherfucking McStud Show. You know what a Snickers is, right? Snicker dick is a one big chocolate dick with a vein in it, I guess. Unless it's like, uh, they make white chocolate Snickers? I don't fucking know. Either way, it's a chocolate dick with a vein. Good times. The first tasty beverage. And I did turn my camera on before I opened this bitch this time. Try to fuck me up. Cheers, motherfuckers. Mmm. Man, it's motherfucking Tuesday, Titty Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. It's not tacos for us. We're having nachos. Which is just as good as fucking tacos. Um, it depends on the tacos. But nachos are always good. And, like, you, I, I don't really like to compare tacos and nachos. Because they, they, one is different than the other. Unless you're having crunchy tacos. Now, if you're getting, like, some regular, like, some street tacos or some shit. Totally different from nachos. I prefer to have both, really. Instead of picking one or the other. But if I have to pick one or the other, I will. I can't pick a favorite because I like them both. Just like your mother's titties. They're both amazing. Mm. Man. These new Red Bulls at work. I just gotta say. What the fuck is a Karuba Elderberry, Karuba, Karuba Elderberry Red Bull? What the fuck is an Elderberry? You know, it sounds like an old woman's twat. You know? Hey, man. Grab me one of those grandma's pussy Red Bulls. Jesus Christ. You know, I can only imagine this shit smells like Dorothy's chair seat from the Golden Girls. Imagine hooking up with an old lady and she says, get down there and suck on this elderberry. Okay. Sure, why not? Is it the older the berry, the sweeter the juice? I think that juice, or that berry is pretty fucking juiceless, you know, looking like an ashy raisin. Not better yet, an ashy date. It's thicker and bigger, you know, and if you eat it, It'll keep you regular. You know? What do you think an old lady's queef smells like? Goddamn, going on Mike Tyson lisp and shit. You know, does it smell like dried fish, smoked dried fish? You know, that's a motherfucking snack right there. You know, your tongue deep in her catacombs and pfft, looking up like you got dinner in the slow cooker. You know? <laughs> How about you? But I like my elderly women in it. That way, when I'm six finger fingers, you know, six fingers deep. And her love shack and flicking her raisin with my tongue, I can't tell if it's piss or squirt. Well, either way, I guess it's all piss, depending on who you ask, you know. But the bottom line is that it's warm and wet, like a tropical turtle tank. As a matter of fact, we we won't call it piss or squirt. We'll call it crush, you know. Kind of like the drink, but named after the turtle from Finding Nemo. And when you're done dislocating that elderly woman's hips, she can have you run down to the cellar and grab some jarred or canned foods. Jarred food, you know, the jarred, you know, jar them and shit. Um, <laughs> um, excuse me. Anyways, grab those jarred food, jarred, uh, jarred foods, and she can use her hover around to get around the kitchen, too, and make you a nice home-cooked meal. It's like Thanksgiving after Dicksgiving. And before you leave, she'll slip you a 20 in your hand so you can grab some candy from the corner store. You know, those grandma always slip you, like, a fucking 20 in your hand or a 5 or a 1 or a quarter Whatever, I mean, some people got lucky and got 20s. No, I mean, I think I got five bucks here and there. No matter what it was, it was nice and generous. They didn't have to do that, but they did, if they could, you know? I mean, I'm even in this bitch's will now, so when she passes, I'll be inherit her, inheriting her 85 gremlin and 10 shillings, you know? Love truly is a wonderful thing. And there's no impregnating Agnes, you know? Um, I swear Agnes is the best. Um, her impregnating parts had rotted off years ago, so I'm busting non-stop nuts in her shame cave. Then I'll just throw a depends on her before she runs to the bathroom so she doesn't leave a trail on the floor. Because I don't want her slipping. Her hips are already hurt when I'm done with her, you know? And you know, she still gives me spit baths, too. <clears throat> but, uh, my favorite spit bath is after anal, you know? She grabs a tissue and spits on it and just wipes her bunny tracks straight off my fucking cock. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'm Mr. Deuces, bitches. Ugh.